All right, we live. Looks like it. All right, so what the heck's it doing? Welcome to the stream, EB, Craig, Michael. <laughs> what the heck was they keep was steam does steam keep updating proton experimental oh well How dare they update stuff. <laughs> Alright, try this again. Right? Well, that's good, though. They got to get ready for... Uh... Getting ready for that Steam Deck, and they've made a whole bunch of bold claims about it. So, we, they're going to need a... I haven't actually, I didn't manage to kill Mr. House yet, but no, I did not, I, I did not reload the hard save before giving the chip to him. Um, I just went ahead and gave the chip to him. I can still kill him. It's probably going to be harder now that he has the chip. But I need better weapons, and I figured, you know... This game is so cool, and, and there's so much stuff to do in this game. There's no real reason to just skip ahead with the main quest and skip everything else. Although at this point, Mr. House may be the easiest way to go. But I'm still going on the uh, Yes Man. All right, sounds working good. But that hard save is uh, still available. <laughs> like if I want to do the, uh, for instance, if I want to do the gun runners quest, I'm probably going to have to. Uh, start bumping up my sneak a lot to get away with that one. Oh, now you want to play Meow Meow. Mouse Trap. Now, what was I doing? Alright, I just got... No, 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 no. Okay, I gotta go back to the uh, Crimson Caravan. So, oh, we probably gotta go outside before we can tr quick travel there. So, uh, no more. We got the whorehouse filled up with uh, fetish whores the last time around, I think. And here we go. So we'll be back to normal, normal fallout stuff. Is that the Crimson Caravan? Nice gun runners. Freeside. What? There's a freaking Kim Crimson Caravan. Isn't it like right up here?
There it is. Jesus. And then uh, maybe we'll start Veronica's quests. Maybe we can start some of Veronica's quests by talking I to her. I've heard that elite units are on the way to support our armies here. One Punch Girl. She's pretty cool. All right, where's this office I want to go to? Yeah. Nope, she's not here. Where's she at? Well, I guess I'll check the barracks. It is daytime, though. Hmm. Sleeping in the daytime. What a slacker. Navy calls me a slacker. Welcome back. The Crimson Caravan Company no longer has to worry about Henry Jameson. Yes, I understand that he's decided to quit outright and not even ask for compensation. I'm a bit curious what exactly you said to him. Then again, perhaps I'd rather not know. Thank you all the same. I'm very happy to be rid of that man. Mm. Goodbye. It's been a pleasure. Yeah, I'm gonna have to start you now to do that gun runner quest. Thanks, E.B., for showing me how to do that. By the way, I'm gonna have to uh, bump up my sneak skills and maybe see how many. Try to remember where I sold uh, um, stealth boys. Although I think I still have a couple. I don't think I sold them all. So let's uh, talk to Veronica. One Punch Girl. You can't help but notice that the Brotherhood barely exists to these people out here. We're like an urban myth. No real presence on the outside. We just don't adapt like we should. Used to be that all you needed to get your way was a suit of power armor and a laser rifle. Now, people are armed and organized. They're not afraid. But we still stick to our old approach because it's all we know. Oh, which one of these two? Let's go. Power armor and laser rifles are still effective. Yeah, but only if you've got bodies to fill the suits. We don't take on new members. We're all descendants from the original Brotherhood. Something's going to have to change, or the empty suits are going to be all that's left of us. Um... Tell me about yourself. I like long walks in the desert and candlelit metal workshops. What are your goals? I want a dress. <laughs> a dress? Yeah, a good one. Something elegant and classy, you know? But still stylish. Something that's eye-catching and sexy, but also says, don't fuck with me. I keep hoping I'll come across some old world designer gown when I'm scavenging, but it never happens. Maybe I should move back to California. I wonder, uh, wonder how well, I wonder how nice she cleans up. Hey, you try getting a date wearing scribe robes. Might as well be wearing sweatpants. I just like them, you know? They make you feel like a woman. Those ladies before the war, they knew what they were doing. Something else about you? Can I make it up? Who was this father Elijah to I would you? say he was my tutor, but that doesn't cover it. After my parents passed, he looked after me. The whole brotherhood brought me up, really, but he made sure of it. 
I never had a grandfather, not that I knew anyway, but Elijah was in some ways what I'd imagined a grandfather to be. Follow him from California? It was by his request, actually. He cleared it with the other elders, somehow. They sent him to look into the dam. There was a time when I had begged to follow, watch him at work. What changed? He did. For years, he fought with the council, taught me to question our direction. Meanwhile, he'd become more out of touch than all of them. On our way east, he demanded we stop at Helios 1 to examine it. While we were there, we received word that the NCR had taken the dam. He was furious. Called it children playing with a bomb, but he was mad because we'd lost his power. What we'd use it for? He didn't even care. How's that different from any other elder would have reacted? They're cautious. When they discover something, they respect it, learn its limits, consider how to preserve it. Used to drive Father Elijah crazy. He liked to learn limits too, but only so he could push them. <laughs> That's not to excuse the other elders, though. They all covet technology for its own sake. Some are just more fanatical than others. Ever tried to talk sense into him? Yeah, I did. I couldn't help him. He just didn't listen. And the idea that people talk back to him... If he could have made the Brotherhood act like machines, ordering them around with the push of a button, he would have. What did you learn from him? Elijah could look at an old device and immediately understand what made it work. And he could see its potential, where it fit with other technology. It's not something he could teach, but he tried with me. Some of it stuck. But that's what he taught me. You ask what I learned from him. How is that different? What did you learn from him? I learned what I don't want to become. In the end, there was just him and his vision. Nothing and no one else. Were you close? Yeah. I miss him. Where is he now? I don't know. Last time anyone saw him was in the battle at Helios 1. I wasn't there. He gave orders to hold the plant until he could be reactivated. But he ran out of time. The NCR overran it. Everyone thought he was dead. But I got a note from him at a comm station. That's how he liked to talk, even to me. He wasn't good at face-to-face. -face. What was in the note? It was... strange. Even for Father Elijah. He's always been unstable, but this was... something else. I don't want to say delusional, but I don't know what else to call it. The only thing familiar about it was the signature. He said the Brotherhood was doomed, but that he'd return, save us. But the way he said it, I don't know. Said he'd return was one of the greatest treasures of the old world. Make the Mojave like it was meant to be. Wipe the slate clean. Tell me something else about you. Like what? Do you have any other... ever been in love? Ever been nosy? <laughs> I was. Once. We were pretty young, but I like to think it was love. What happened? She left the Brotherhood. Wanted to put some distance between herself and her parents. Since our membership isn't open to outsiders, some members think that obligates all of us to procreate. You can guess which camp her parents belong to. You didn't go with her? No. Couldn't bring myself to leave everyone else behind. Couldn't convince her to stay, either. Right? I'd hoped love would be enough to influence her decision, but it wasn't. We were both too stubborn. I don't know where she is now, but I'm sure she's moved on. Maybe we'll find a pretty dress for her to wear. Her. Once in a while. Uh, something else about you? Like what? Do you have any other family in the Brotherhood? Just my parents, but they haven't been around for a long time. Dad was a paladin, Mom was a scribe. They died in the same battle, trying to hold off the NCR from... something. I don't remember what it was. Guess it seemed important at the time. <laughs> Do 
tell me something else about like you. Uh, are you well respected among other members of the Brotherhood? If you take trying to keep me as far away from Hidden Valley as possible because I ask too many difficult questions as a sign of respect, oh yeah. That's not to say I don't get along with them. I just think they don't know what to do with me sometimes. Like what? Is there some place you wanted me to take you? No, we're specific. I just know there are a lot of groups who are actually doing well for themselves out here. I want to understand how and why. See them at work. Ah, uh, is that a... Uh, what's about other things? Ooh, got any juicy gossip? Alright, is there anything else? Could you help me craft something? Step into my office. Huh. All right. So she's got some crafting skills. Anything My else here? My favorite subject. All right, so that's pretty much specific. I just know there are a lot of groups who are actually doing well for themselves out here. I want to understand how and why. See them at work. Alright, let's keep moving. Let's. Let's check our quest. There's some way I think you just gotta basically walk by it. What do we got what do we got for quest? Bug and access point. I can't do that quest. I done messed it up. I thought I did that one. Why is it still lit? Alright, let's go with this one. Make contact with the Brotherhood of Steel. And show location. Ah, we know we're... In. So let's, uh, what's close to there? Have I been to Sloan? I've not discovered this location. I haven't. I have been to Helios. Let's go to Helios 1. Oh. I gotta get out of here. Interesting. Anyway, let's start. Let's meet this brotherhood. So. Oh, I wanted to go back to the NCR Correctional Facility at some point also and kill those people. There's some more people there. But let's... Go to Gene Skydiving and head towards, uh, and then from there we'll head towards, uh, the Brotherhood. Now, is there going to be powder gangers here every time, or is this some creatures? It's probably I think that's the way to Hidden Valley let's go for these creatures I see, oh there's there's some 
that don't look healthy. I could do the humping the Mojave mod, but I don't think that'd go very well. I don't think that'd go over well on the YouTubes. <laughs> I'll just go for the uh, wings. Oh, come on. I finally, I hit the thing. Is that going to be radio and erase some radioactive muck that thing fell in? Let's get closer this time. That's better. Alright. Let's just start heading towards Hidden Valley. That's not what I'm going to crouch first. All right. I think that's probably Hidden Valley there train tracks. These train tracks are still pretty nice looking. Let's go ahead and check the map. Yep, heading straight towards Hidden Valley. save can we get up here crouch bandits of some sort Powder gangers. Trouble. Yep. Oh, come. Oh, shit. Dynamite. I'll oh, shoot him in the head. Oh, man. I forgot to reload. That's, that's all right. And one punch girl got that one. Nice. Oh, oh yeah, we'll take beer, bottle caps, dynamite, dynamite, dynamite. Salisbury steak. And the switchblade ain't. Now these guys tend to that's almost worth taking how much does it weigh it's not worth a whole lot but okay take the whiskey I don't want to carry armor around. Hey, Sleepy Eyes Vents. Welcome to the stream.
Oh man, no, no! These guys tend to... tend to leave mines around. What's the heck's up with that? Get out of there. Okay, good. What is that? Yeah. There, got that one. Dang booby trappers. So, um, Discovered Hidden Valley. Quick save. Have a good night, morning, or what have you, Craig. Is that the entrance? Ventilation. Aha. Hey. Uh -huh. on my radar. Well, if it's on the other side of the fence. Never mind. All right. All right, let's just uh find this entrance. Uh-oh. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Boy, she's just overpowered. What, she get them both in one, one punch? Holy cow. All right. Ventilation. We're close to uh, something. 
Looks like we got a bunch. Of, it seems to be rad scorpion infested around these parts. What the? There's a whole bunch of something around here, huh? Okay, there's the entrance. This must not be the place I thought it was. There's one where like a sandstorm comes by every time you uh okay they're out they seem to be outside the fence so let's go ahead and see if i'm making a mistake here what oh they're outside the oh well let's get them Okay, never mind. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Come on. She's pretty awesome. All right, let's see. Let's see if any of these things got meat in them. Or she just smashed the living daylights out of them. Poison gland. Oh, bark scorpions. But we'll take the experience. All right. Quick save again. And let's. Yeah, I don't think this is the bunker I was at before. Interesting. All right, let's try the intercom. Try again. One more time. Let's try to open the door. Whoa! Hold knee B. There we go. What the heck happened in here? No wonder there wasn't no sandstorm. Don't look like anybody's home. I hope I don't get myself stuck.
wonder what the heck happened here. Huh. What is that? So this isn't the bunker that I've been to before. Interesting. So. Huh. Let me go in there one more time and then check the map while I'm in there. Maybe there's something I missed. But I don't think I can uh, get in there. I don't see no way to get past all that rubble. So that was the okay. There, so there's nothing there. Something bad happened there. Does she know anything? You know, I've been thinking. The real problem with <coughs> Brotherhood is that we isolate ourselves. Our training is top notch, our technology gives us an advantage. But when it all comes down to it, we're losing because we shun the outside world. We always make enemies, never allies. We refuse to recruit outsiders or see the value in their simpler technologies. Its knowledge is dangerous. Sure, but how long before the NCR or Caesar's Legion track us down and take it by force anyway? But if we recruited knights from outside the group, Maybe we could actually defend it. I know the odds aren't good, but I gotta try. I can't lose them. All right. See you around. All right, so... Now what do we want to do? What is this? And why is it sending us here? Northwest, huh? And it looks like... Looks like there's some new places to meet along the way, so let's just kind of head west-northwest and see where the heck that marker's taking us. Head out the fence there. Uh-oh. 
Well, she's having all the fun killing the stuff. Ain't giving me a chance. <laughs> and at some point, I do want to meet back up with uh, Boone and maybe get figure out how to get his quest to uh, Bitter Springs started Oh boy Check out the old bowl. Check out the old uh, machinery there. Uh oh. What? Well, oh boy. Something tells me it might be time for machine guns. Yep. Got some ammo for that. <laughs> All right, one punch girl got that one. What happened to that one over yonder? Empty. Well, what happened to these? Huh. I'll take your caps. Alright, I better I better quick save. His death claws are probably something I don't want to mess with. We'll see, B. We shall see. Did I got one punch girl with me. Did you see how she just punched the shit out of that thing? Boy, these shoes sure can take a beating, can't they? Uh-oh. I'll shoot him in the head. Oh, no. Well, that worked, though. Holy cow! All right. So be it. We probably want to stay closer to the road. Yeah, that's not the right way to go. <laughs> yeah, those biggins are, uh... 
are a bit much. I think now I know what the rocket launchers are for. <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? We can go... I see a camp up that way. Let's go see what's up there. Yeah, I'll need... Oh, cut... Shut up, phone. Now I'm a slacker. I forgot to turn all the sound down on my phone before I started this. Oh, I hate touch screens. Come on. There we go. What the heck? Warning, death claws ahead. Yeah, I figured that out. I'll check out that train. What the? There's someone Poor here. Snuffles. Wish somebody could do something about his leg. When do you think the NCR will send their troops to Generator's help? Generator's still not working. Big surprise. When do you think the NCR will send their troops to help us? Let's check this train and then go check out building over there. There's just so much stuff in this game. Well, it don't look like there's anything there. It's too damn hot. Can't believe anyone actually made it through from the north, what with all the death claws at the quarry. You returning from New Vegas? Where'd the death claws come they from? They moved into the quarry after the powder gangers came through and made off with most of our dynamite. Oh, I do have dynamite we to throw out. We shut the quarry out, but... down while we waited for the NCR to get us some more blasting sticks. But now the death claws have shown up. The NCR is a no-show. And my men and I have got nothing to do but sit on our asses all day. It's damn frustrating. I don't know. I don't think I want to tell them I can take care of the death claw problem. If I do tell them that, I'm going to have to do it much later. Have problems with the death claws before? Uh, we'd see them occasionally, but they didn't seem too keen on getting too close to the quarry. Not sure if it was the noise or all the workers. I can't believe that an entire pack moved into the quarry. I thought that kind of bad luck only happened in New Vegas. Well, that'd be a lie. What do you mean by that, E.B.? Are you saying uh, um, Fallout 3 is easier? Well, we'll start this question. I don't question. know what it is about you, but I think you could actually pull it off. Death Claws are tough bastards, but you might be even tougher. Well, maybe I'll Nobody come back with a rocket launcher. Nobody cares you in a fight against Death Claws, but take these medical supplies. You'll probably need them. To do the job right, you've got to get rid of the pack leaders, the Mother Death Claw and the Death Claw Alpha Male. Should run the rest of them off. Well, I got some. Oh, I got some nice stuff. Ah, a bunch of escape cons from down south. The NCR was using them to maintain the railways as part of their sentence. I don't know who screwed up, <coughs> but the powder gangers are loose. It was one group that attacked us and took our entire supply of dynamite. Something else? Okay. What is this place? This is Sloan, a camp for us quarry workers. 
The actual quarry, Quarry Junction, is up the road north of here. The whole thing is an NCR operation. I don't got no mods here. We make cement for the NCR using the limestone we dig out with dynamite. Oh, and I see. Lines. Dirty work, but the pay is good. Wish we got paid in caps, though. Not a lot of merchants like taking NCR paper money. What's the NCR need with the cement? It all gets shipped by rail over towards Boulder City and Hoover Dam. The NCR is probably building fortifications with it all. That's a drag line. Yeah. It's a big machine which moves rocks If I end up with a rocket launcher, maybe it's I'll come back tech, here. So you need to thump it once in a while to keep it running. You don't get paid in caps? No. Nope. The NCR has been trying to switch over to using paper money, just like in the pre-war days. Trouble is that the exchange rates ain't exactly fair. For example, a hundred bucks in NCR money is valued at roughly half that in caps around here. Seems like a rotten deal for us, but work is work. Anything else to talk to sure. this guy about? I guess we could see what he thinks about New Vegas. I've been there once, and I don't recommend it. It's <laughs> just a way to burn through a month's pay in five minutes. I've seen a lot of folks come through here thinking they'll have the easy life once they get there. It never happens. All right, cool. Well, I'm not gonna. If the 10 millimeter submachine gun doesn't do anything to him, if you insist on going north, don't be expecting a rescue when you get into trouble. I, poor Snuffles. Wish somebody could do something about his leg. Man, I wish I'd stay back in California some days. What the heck? Is that guy got a pet mole rat? Snuffles. <laughs> Woof. Hmm, your leg appears to be injured. Woof. Let's go ahead and fix it up. Hey, got some experience. That's interesting. Ha! <laughs> Check that thing out. Now that, see this. I've heard the Legion's planning to unleash their best men against us. This generator would provide power if it was functional. Whoever assembled it had no idea. Many parts properly. Assemble the generator. The death claws have been keeping their distance. Oh, cool. For now. That's funny. <laughs> well, what else have we got around? I haven't been here before. table anything else all right what's upstairs no one's even in here So, machine shop, they don't want me to go in. Mess hall. Do, 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 do. Aha. Hey. Let me ask you a question. Oh, boy. What's the tastiest thing you've ever eaten? Anything that wasn't made 200 years ago? Uh, 
Yeah, can you believe some people still eat that stuff? Anyway, I've got this recipe for a death claw omelet that I've been itching to try out. <laughs> Trouble is, I'll a death claw egg. Kind of obvious, I suppose. Where did you come up with this recipe? My great aunt Rose ran a bed and breakfast back in California in a town called Modoc. She's the one who created the recipe in the first place. I don't know how she managed to get a hold of a female death claw, but she kept it in a shed. What the? Aunt Rose had a steady supply of eggs for her omelets. At least she did until some stranger came along and killed the death claw, shot it right in the eye. Where can I find a death claw egg? The quarry just north of here is full of death claws, so there's uh, bound yeah, to be an I'm egg or two in there, there somewhere. Yet. Of course, a death claw egg from anywhere will do. According to my aunt Rose, those things have a ridiculously long shelf life. What are you offering in exchange? I don't have much in the way of money, but I'd be willing to share the secret of the recipe. All right, let's talk about something else. All right. Do you need anything to eat or drink? Uh, show me what you got for sale. Sure thing. All right, she's got some caps. Let's see, what do I want to get rid of here? A grenade launcher might help, too. Maybe the armor-piercing bullets are what I should use. Let's get rid of these. I probably should have kept the barrel cactus root. Just get rid of these just to get rid of them. Since I'm not crafting. Low light vision, that's what I thought. Coyote hides. Coyote meat. I want to keep that. Let's sell her some dynamite, but keep most of it. I'll keep it, get it down to ten. Yeah. Wrap me. Oh, I do have a grenade rifle. So I could. Boy, that thing's, uh. That thing's pretty nice, too. I have missiles, but not a missile launcher, huh? Let's get rid of the plasma defender. All the pre-war money. Okay, let's accept. And exit. Another satisfied customer. Goodbye. All right, then. Oh, I forgot to see what she even had. Hey there, what's new? Sure thing. I'll take your sunset sarsaparillas, actually. Well, okay, maybe there's... Okay, accept. And exit. Another satisfied customer. All right, then. 
Anything else interesting around these parts? So, so now the question is, let's go ahead and quick save. And do I dare? Probably not. But. Even if I die, I'll figure out if this grenade rifle's effective against them at all. It's not like I'm going to do much here with only four grenades, but... I'll see if there's anything I can do. See if it's effective anyway. Okay, there's one. That thing doesn't look very little either, does it? This is more of a recon mission to see if the grenade rifle would do anything Trouble. against them. Come on, get close enough for me. There you go. Holy cow. Yep, alright, so... Yep. The grenade rifle isn't even worth a crap against them. All right, cool. Yeah, those are tough bastards. The grenade rifle didn't do shit. <laughs> I'm gonna have to try missiles. So. Not going there. Red Rock Canyon. Alright, so Hidden Valley isn't going to do us any good. We go north, we're screwed unless we tr quick travel first. What the heck is this? Is that where the Great Cons are? Why is this still lit? What haven't I done yet? I've done... Huh. Yeah, that's not gonna help me much. So, actually,
Okay, I've been to the El Rey Motel. So let's, uh... Maybe we can avoid, uh... Vegas Steel, South Vegas Ruins, the East Entrance, Sunset Spasparilla Headquarters, and Vault 3. What was up with Vault 3? I can't remember. So let's go southwest and just explore. go up onto the other side, it looks like, instead of staying down here on the road. Oh no! Man, those dang mines, that means those are probably powder gangers up there, huh? They're the ones that seem to like to set mines all over the place. I guess it's time to put those sunset sarsaparillas to use. Interesting. All right. How am I doing on Sunset Spasparilla anyway? Ah, uh, not terrible. What's on the radar? Ah, oh, yep, there's something. Are they fiends? Take the cigarette. That's too heavy for me to want to carry, although. Um, I guess it's worth something. These fiends are pretty tough, actually. Yeah, I'll take the laser rifle. Hmm. All right, I've been going for over an hour now. Running a desktop late at night. So, I'll go a little bit longer here. I want to, uh, I 
if you're in the heavy metal at six in the morning six in the morning mountain time love bites is uh showing their new dvd of this year's concert on youtube for free oh man yeah <laughs> whoa I want to check that out. <laughs> All right, one punch girl to the rescue. She's good to have around. Yes, because I can probably combine all that armor and get it repaired. And it's worth that it's worth more that way anyway. These fiends are pretty tough. Cook cook. I already killed him. I thought before I actually didn't do too bad here I didn't take as much damage as I thought I was gonna something the all right Don't look like it wants to attack. All right. How's that? This should. Is that gas station someplace I've been before? Let's go ahead. Do another sunset sarsaparilla. Let's see what we got here. Where are they at? Oh boy, there's a bunch of them. Whatever they is. That doesn't look like a healthy place to hang out. Poseidon gas station. And that looks boarded up, boarded up. And can I get in there? Nope, and it's rads. Stay away from the rads. What the heck is that a... That looks like the Fiend's big camp, don't it? What the heck is that a... All right, quick save. Check for mines. Check for mines. See how close we can get. I'm gonna have to increase my sneak skills. I don't see any mines. All right. Dogs, is that what we got? 
fiend guard dog. I think I've been here before. What the? Oh, I gotta use the doctor's bag or something. But it would appear... That. Alright, let's go back down. How do we get down now? See if we can sleep in one of these trailers and get ourselves healed up. Not here. Is it just going to be more dogs? Nice. Cool. All right. Check our map. Let's go ahead and start heading straight west-ish, see what those are. Over yonder, Vault 3, I seem to remember something about Vault 3, we'll check it out while we're here in the area too sometime. But I'm going to see what those two hash marks are. Well, I'm probably not going to be going for much longer tonight. If I can even climb up there. Hmm. Where am I trying to go? Hmm. Trouble. 
I see him. How do I get up to wherever it is? Well, that's a hell of a place to try to get to. Whatever the heck is there. Looks like my companions can't get here. I cannot save right now. Okay, now. Now can I save? Yeah, I'm about, I'm probably going to only go about 10 more minutes, Eves. Have a good day at work. Get up there. Is there another way? Don't look like it. I sure don't know how to get there. There's got to be a way up there, though, don't there? Try going around the other way. Where is EDE? Okay, there's EDE. <coughs> All right, we'll come and get these. Uh, might as well collect some meat. See if we can find a way to get to the top of this thing. Is 
is where I tried before. Okay, that doesn't look promising. Come on, how do you get up there? There must be a way. Ah, that looks promising. don't. Although over there doesn't maybe look too shabby. What the... A scarecrow? That's a way to get up there. But what is this place? Come on, companions. Just a wrecked old house. What the... There's something up there. All right, there's EDE. Where'd run? Where'd one? Where'd Veronica end up? Quick save. There she is. More experience points coming up. Hopefully they're not death claws. Well, look at this pretty old park area. Spring Mountain Ranch. Big Horners, take it. Yeah, I, f I figured that was going to happen. Let's go to apparel first. And get... take care of us for now. <laughs> I've had worse. One punch girl's pretty badass. Just a house. A 
Oh boy, there's a bunch of stuff that way. Reload. Before I forget what I'm doing. I'm going to try to head I'm going to set myself up to head towards whatever the hex that way. So I saw a building off in the distance there before I discovered the ranch. And it looks like that's actually some place I can get to. So, cool. This game's just so cool. There's all kinds of neat stuff around here. So, I'm not sure what's up there, but. Next time around, we'll be checking it out. If I can get there. Holy cow. All right. I'm going to quick save here. I'm going to call it for the night. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, subscribe, yeah, subscribe also while you're busy subscribing, whatever that is, <laughs> and <laughs> ring the notification bell and all that rot, and I will see you later. Thanks for watching. If I didn't say hello to anybody in the chat, sorry about that, and uh, have a good day, and check out, what the heck's downloading? And check out Love Bites in about four hours. If you're into any kind of heavy metal at all, they are just, uh... Well, I'll just put it this way. As far as actual talent goes, and how uh, how well... As, as, just, as far as pure talent goes, um, and how, how expert they are at musicianship and playing their instruments, they've... They got to be the best metal band in the world. I mean, I like Nymophila better, but uh, you can't fault the musicianship of Love Bites whatsoever. And like I said, in about four hours, they're going to have, uh, they're going to uh, um, broadcast their new DVD live on the YouTube. So uh, check that out if you like some hard rock, heavy metal type music. I sure am. And I'll see you later. Cheers.